John has been driving for three months, 24 days, and 17 hours. Why? John is a curious one. Not only is he curious how long does it take to the center of a tasty roll pop, he's also curious how long does it take for his timing belt to snap. You see, his owner's manual says he should change it at 60,000 miles, but he wants to see how long it can really go. You see, your timing belt has some mystery to it, just like the Tasty Roll Pop. You don't know exactly when the inevitable change is going to occur. A university thought they could use science and know exactly when you get to the center of a Tasty Roll Pop, and even built a machine to test it. They found between 257 and 361 licks to get to the center. Which is why you could put a sticker on the outside of a Tasty Roll Pop saying approximately 250 licks to get to the center. The engineers at your brand's car company have done the same thing, but in a lot more detail, to figure out exactly how long your timing belt will last. They know if it's not replaced, it's inevitable, it will snap. When that happens, your pistons can clash with the cylinder heads, which is a devastating collision and an expensive tow, then repair. We want to help you avoid that. Where our timing belt and Tasty Roll Pop are not similar is when you inevitably get to the center of a Tasty Roll Pop, it's a wonderful thing. So get yourself a Tasty Roll Pop and give our shop a call if you have any questions about when your manufacturer recommends your time belt needs to be replaced so you can get it taken care of and avoid that expensive surprise.